Hey, what's going on YouTube? Kyle Later, aka Smooth Flipper. And in this video, we're going to go over how I feel about eBay fees. So for those who know, eBay does have fees, so does PayPal. Um, and I've been getting questions about, you know, why I'm, am I still selling on eBay um, when they have all these fees, you know, your profits are being taken just because of uh, the fees. And just wanted to go over, you know, my reasoning as, as to why I still sell on eBay and um, why it shouldn't really affect your business. So the first point that I do want to go over is as far as eBay and PayPal taking fees for um, you selling an item. My opinion is it's just business. Um, you know, they need their cut. You know, who, if their cut is 10% of the sale, then it is what it is. Um, you know, as sellers, we know this, you know, going in. Uh, as a seller, you, you know, everybody knows that you're going to get charged a fee for, you know, what you sell. And if you sell a bunch of stuff, you might get an invoice, uh, you know, on 13th or 15th of the month and you have to pay back eBay, you know, a thousand, fifteen hundred dollars because you sold so much on eBay. So, you know, you kind of have to factor that in when you are, um, you know, making deals. That's what I do. I factor in that those eBay fees so I'm not you know hit as hard as if I wasn't to factor them in so keep that in mind guys it is just business and you know you can't really let that stop you from starting or continuing your business um, this next point I want to go over is you know as you know even though eBay does have these fees you have to realize that they are promoting your item for you um, you know and they are promoting your item to thousands and thousands of people who may come across your item so you know there's times where you look at the item you can see the views and then you know you have a thousand plus views in the first 24 hours so you know where else can you for free um post you know an item for sale and get that many views you know without with, with without you know being charged a, a thing if you're doing facebook ads or instagram ads you're obviously paying um Facebook and you know and Instagram to get your product out there. So eBay does the same thing. You know, it's 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 a bit more um, established as far as you know. It's been around for a while. People go in there to shop and they they figured out that they have to charge people fees uh, for them to sell. So there you go. Um, the next point I want to go over is you know I've had phones sell on eBay for you know in, in less than ten seconds. You know, in less than a minute um same day in, within the first hour and you know look, these profits are 80 100 bucks 200 dollars um and that's from putting them on ebay you know i've had times where i've even uh tested it out and put a phone on ebay and put a phone in, in my local uh, uh offer up and in, in, in facebook and realized that ebay was ebay was a lot faster you know as far as getting that sale um, and you know, still would, would have made the same amount of money, but uh, eBay is just faster. You get more eyes to it. People know what they what they want to buy when they go on eBay and search for it. Um, and you know, a lot of times you don't get much bartering when they are finding a product. As far as if you were if you were to sell locally, you know, you get a lot of messages from people who want you know twenty thirty dollars less than what your what your asking price is. Um, so the, the fact that you know you can sell a phone in seconds on eBay is ridiculous, um, and, and in my opinion, it's worth it's worth the fee. You know, it's worth the fee that you can you know you can turn your money around so quick, um, and have that money in your PayPal account ready to be transferred. That 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 in my opinion is worth uh, the fees. Another point I do want to go over is um, the co comparing you know having my own site to sell phones that I do get. Uh, versus eBay. So if I was, you guys are thinking about it, if I was to have my own site created, um, I'm not, I'm not good at, I'm not a great site. So I have to pay for somebody for that. Um, I'm not the best at Facebook ads, uh, and and you know, and you know, getting those leads effectively for for cheap price. I'm not really good at that unless I spend hours and hours on it. Um, so I'm gonna have to pay somebody for that. Uh, it doesn't stop there. You have to pay people for um you know certain words adwords certain uh seos all that different stuff that goes into marketing your website you know all that is going to come out of pocket you know there's 
there's a couple people that I've talked to who do have websites and they've you know they've put down five ten thousand dollars uh, on just the marketing aspect of their website and haven't even sold an item yet so um, for me I don't I don't feel like it's necessary to be in the whole you know five ten thousand dollars before I can even sell an item because you do have to you do have to get that website going um, you have to get people to trust your website people trust eBay because they know eBay goes through PayPal PayPal is trusted um, you know throughout the world and it's you, you don't need to you don't need to gain trust from from different people who who go on uh, the site so that's a good plus um, and you know so so that that is what it is it does it's a lot better in my opinion to have my own, to have an eBay uh, you know store or whatever versus having my own site it's just a lot more money I have to put into it to get to get my site name out out there to buy different um, you know words and, and all that how that works I'm not really a marketing expert but I know a little bit about it um, there's a lot of money you have to put into it and uh, my last thoughts on it is yeah I do I can agree that um, eBay fees are, are, are pretty high they're up there um, when I first started there was they were not you know that high um, but like I said eBay has to make their money it's business things go up in price over the years so um, you know the fees going up was expected by me and by anybody else who have been on eBay for a while so um, hope you guys enjoyed the video hope you guys uh, got some value out of it and and can uh, come to the realization that that it is it all it is all just business and you know even though we're all trying to make money um, that's all it kind of is coming down to is making that money and eBay and PayPal have to make it and you have to respect that if you're going to be selling on their site to get your products um, viewed you know thousands and thousands of times so again I hope you guys enjoyed it if you do enjoy the video please like uh, drop a comment and if you're new to the channel please subscribe and I will catch you guys in the next video